Tutorials by Andrew Buckle. In this tutorial I'm just going to show you how you can use the arc tool and the tilt character just over here and the arc tool. Now arc tool is not particularly great most of the time but you can use it for some interesting effects holding the tilt down. So now I've got black set for the stroke I'm just going to apply it now and you can see the design straight away you can create some nice sort of curved designs just drag that around Sort of. And at that point, you can see design there. I can get rid of that very quickly as well. And again, I can just apply it again. Just go around, move that around like that, and hold the till down. And you can see you can create this interesting sort of fan design very quick and easy. You don't have to go all the way around, just like that. Or again, you can create the other way. And I'm going to hold down the tilt again, and you can see just create a You can maybe create it so it builds up outwards as well. So you can start from the centre and just spread out like a spray just by doing that. And you can go back into the centre again and maybe add a few additional parts there like that. So it's a sort of a fountain effect maybe more. And of course you can apply it once, you can apply it multiple times. So you can also change the settings so I can just move that up a bit. Click there, you've got various range of settings, so you can modify the convex, you can modify various other things, and then you can obviously just create so I don't want that. Hold the till down again, and you can just apply it to spread it out. And of course, it's just a set of paths, you can always move that set of paths, you can combine it, you can obviously hold the alt down, so you can create multiple sprays like that, you can modify the opacity. Numerous possibilities, and again, just move that. Now, also what you can do, obviously I'm going to get rid of all those, just get rid of those as well, don't want those, and hold that, tilt it down, and then just spray it around, and you can change the colour, I'm going to go for red, and I'm going to apply it again, hold the tilt down, and spray it over there, and maybe go for green and so on and so on. So you can go for very interesting colourful effect just by adding multiple lines on top of each other as well. Hope you found this of interest. Thank you much.